What up YouTube? I'm really excited about today's video. After over a year of trying to score the Adidas Campus 80 South Park Tally sneakers, I finally hit. Hang out with me for a few minutes and I'll show you all around this crazy collab. I'll show you all the interesting hidden features that you probably haven't seen on other kicks and I'll show you some shots on foot. This one's gonna be fun, so let's get started. These towel leaves were originally released on 420, 2021. I tried to score at that time, but unfortunately I struck out. Fast forward a year and change and the Adidas Confirmed app did another drop. I acted fast and luckily I was able to score my pair for retail at 100 US dollars. I was very happy when I hit. This is such a fun shoe that I wanted it the moment I saw them. I'm a fan of South Park and besides Randy Marsh, Towley is my favorite character on the show. So these are right up my alley. Now let's take a full look at these Towleys starting with the box. But before I do, I ask that you please click the like button if you're feeling the content. Please subscribe to stay up to date on my latest videos. It's completely free and it would really help my channel. Thank you and now back to the box. It's a very colorful South Park design with a playful look and feel. The entire box has a matte finish with glossy spot UV covering the logo and characters. What's cool is the character and logos are also embossed, so you feel them popping off the packaging. It's hard to show on camera, but it's a very nice touch that they didn't have to do. On the top, you have a very nice Adidas South Park co-branding, and on one side you have the main characters of South Park, Stan, Kyle, Cartman, and Kenny. When you flip the box around, you have a shot of the man himself, Towley. When you open them up, you see this crazy South Park branded tissue paper that's really colorful. Now I know you wear the shoes and not the box, but I gotta give props to whoever designed this packaging. You could tell they put love into this and there's something so satisfying when you unbox a pair of kicks with fun creative packaging. It adds to the whole experience. Now I know it's all just part of their marketing strategy, but I still like it. Pulling the sneakers out, you have the classic Adidas Campus 80s in this white and light chalk purple towel colorway. Pretty much the entire upper of the shoe is made from this towel material, which is fitting considering these are the towelies. You're a towel. On both sides, you have the signature three Adidas stripes, and working your way up the sneaker, you have matching purple laces with these two-tone aglets. The aglets are meant to match Tally's socks and shoes. It's very subtle, but I appreciate that attention to detail. Moving further up the shoe, you'll notice two big eyes on each tongue with a little black eyebrows. These are obviously Tally's eyes, but one very cool touch is when you step outside or put these in bright light, his eyes get bloodshot with a bunch of veins, similar to how he sometimes looks on the show. I have no idea what's going on. It's pretty funny and also very fitting for the character. That's a cool and interesting feature on the tongue, but it doesn't end there. There's actually many more interesting features all over the tongue. Aside from the color changing eyes, the back of the tongue contains some of the Tally's most famous quotes. Check it out. On the left foot, it reads Tally's catchphrase. Don't forget to bring a towel. Don't forget to bring a towel. And on the right side, it reads, I have no idea what's going on. I have no idea what's going on. It's classic towely. Another cool feature is this Velcro stash pouches on each side of the tongue. You can use these to carry cash, spare change, or maybe even a little tegrity. Time to show you some tegrity. The craziness doesn't end there. When you slip your hand inside the left pouch, you'll find a smiling towely keychain with the same catchphrase. And on the back, the Adidas South Park co-branded logos debossed in metal. When you reach inside the right pouch, you'll find another keychain with a red-eyed tally with the right foot's corresponding quote. One very cool subtle touch on both of these keychains that you might not have noticed, they put little yellow Adidas on tally. I love that, but I'm surprised they didn't add it to the box too. This is such a cool touch, and I love all these little extras and subtle details. It makes them feel like a collector's piece and something you just want to save, but for me, these are definite summer kicks and something I would wear to the pool or maybe to a beach barbecue. I can't explain it, but wearing these just changes my whole vibe. It puts me in tally mode and they make me smile. The sock liner and back part of the tongue is made up of what I think is matching purple nylon. I don't think this is leather, but I could be wrong. And the insole is that same purple with the Adidas and South Park co-branding in white. It looks very clean. The heel tab is also white with the classic Adidas branding. A little fun fact, this three leaf logo and the three stripes were originally meant to represent North America, Europe, and Asia because early in the company, that's where their products were sold. Working your way down the shoe, you have a simple white midsole and a classic Campus 80s all white outsole. These are tough to keep clean, but it is what it is. I like the Campus 80s, but my two biggest problems with them are one, how long and narrow the feet look. Sometimes they just don't work with every fit. And two, how narrow the rear sole is. Take a look. The uppers stick out further than the sole. That's never made sense to me, and it's pretty easy to roll your ankle in these if you're not careful. Regarding fit, they fit true to size, and they're relatively comfortable. They're not Adidas Ultra Boost comfortable. You can't expect that, but considering how old this silhouette is, it's really not bad at all. For example, these originally released in the early 1970s as a low-top basketball sneaker. 
At the time, they were called the Tournament. Then in the 1980s, Adidas changed the name to Campus. That makes his silhouette around 50 years old. That's crazy when you put it into perspective. If I'm being honest, I've only owned maybe one or two pairs of Campus 80s in my life. I like them, but I was never a huge fan of this silhouette. That being said, this particular pair hits so hard to me. It's fun, funny, kind of weird, kind of cozy, and very different. They give me good vibes, and they're just fun to wear. This collab was so random and unexpected, just like Tally the character, and I think that's one of the reasons people like these so much. It's completely out of left field, but I'm glad they made them. Props to Adidas, I think you killed it with this one. So in conclusion, I really like these kicks. I like the packaging, I like the towel material, the crazy color changing eyes, the hidden quotes, the stash pouches, the keychains, all wrapped in a classic Adidas silhouette. They're collectible, they're a conversation piece, and there's something different. Plus, they were relatively affordable at 100 US dollars, and I believe no animals had to die to make them. For me, it's a no-brainer. If you're looking for these on the resale market, it's really not too bad, and you'll probably pay around 130 to 140 US dollars for them, depending on your size. That said, I do predict that dead stock pairs will fetch higher prices in the years to come, but that will take some time. Anyway, that's my video on the Adidas Campus 80s South Park Towelies. I hope you liked it. If you did, please throw me a like, please subscribe, and ring that notification bell to stay up to date on my latest videos. You can also check me out on TikTok or Instagram at E21Life. I'm always posting random content there. Thank you all for watching. I really appreciate it. And until next time, stay safe, everyone. Peace.